Dr. Joseph Martin here. The true meaning and purpose of meditation, connecting to spirit. Well, this is going to be very brief and short and to the point. Now, much as I love doing exercise and doing different kinds of hatha yoga and so on, there is a deep ancient purpose to yoga and meditation that means union with spirit, and that's the actual Sanskrit translation, union with God or spirit or source. And this is a point uh, that I'd like to get across at this time in society worldwide in the 21st century when there's so many challenges and people are needing to find that inner peace, that inner foundation, that inner center that holds no matter what is going on inside and around you. And that's why we have yoga and meditation for humans on planet Earth, in ancient times and in modern times. As I say, I love exercise, physical exercise, and I work out, and I'm hoping that you do too. I mean, yoga is not, and meditation is not really just for that. That's just the physical body. Nor is meditation just for the astral emotional body, although as a psychologist I know how important that is to transmute all of your emotions and energies in your astral body. Nor is meditation and yoga just for your causal mental body with all the mental thoughts that come and go and come and go and of course all the thoughts in the unconscious that need to be brought to the conscious. The real purpose of yoga and meditation then is this, to connect to the ether, to the akasha, to the source, to spirit, and that is your home as a human divine soul. That's what meditation and yoga was for uh, two and a half billion years ago when we were only etheric beings coming down to a very etheric planet Earth watery planet earth that was the purpose of yoga and meditation by our ancestors all through polaria lemuria and into early atlantis and therefore as a human species it's still the purpose for yoga and meditation to reconnect us to the remembrance that we are one with the source in spirit this is true for our first nations ancestors the whole purpose is to connect our heart with spirit. It's true for all the Eastern peoples, whether you're Hindu, Buddhist, Sikh, Jain, or Zen, or Vajrayana, Tibetan Buddhist. And it's true for everyone in the Western world, whether you're Gnostic or whether you are Christian. Connecting with spirit and source is the purpose of yoga, meditation, prayer, and open-heartedness. Dr. Joseph Martin, all love and blessings to you.